Hello and welcome. You're watching Don Bosco Media Network. This is Abigail Karmalim bringing you the Salation News across the globe. Don Bosco is a universal saint and no one who has the, had the opportunity to get to know him or his personality can remain indifferent to him. From the young people of the first oratory at Valdoco to the youngsters who today attend the Count Desolation Works, scattered across five continents, everyone has their own special relationship with the father and teacher of youth. For this reason, in view of the 207th anniversary of Don Bosco's birth, next 16th August, we ask the members of the General Council to share with us who St. John Bosco is for them. Opening this cycle of interviews today is a General Councillor for the Mission's Father Alfred Maravilla. Although in many parts of the world this is a time of vacation and relaxation, the Salations and the many young people and lay people who voluntarily collaborate with them have not forgotten those who have been suffering the consequences of the war in Ukraine for almost half a year now. So many initiatives are still taking place in various countries and today we give an account of what is happening mainly in the provinces of Slovakia, SLK, Spain, Mary Help of Christians, SMX and North Poland, PLO. At the end of the pastoral and school year, the Salesian community of the Boskulak Mission organized anti-win to thank all the people of goodwill who supported the Salesian Mission. The Salesian community, Boskulak, is the only formation house of the delegation of the Central African province located in the east of the country in Mugunya, near Bunyu, a sub-urban area about 20 kilometers from the city of Goma. The most vulnerable and disadvantaged populations live there and young people gladly attend the mission to ask the Salations present to organize various recreational and religious activities. Boskulak gives boys and girls the opportunity to learn a trade at its vocational training center in cutting and sewing and to develop their talents at the oratory, attended by about 100 young people which organizes activities in theater, music and sports. 31 Ukrainian youth from the city of Zytomyr, Ukraine, came to Poland's Warsaw province at the invitation of the Slesian parishes of Suvaki and Ruanistok to spend some time on vacation. The program of the visit includes, among other things, a visit to Bialystok, a kayaking activity on the Zarna Hagza River, a cruise on the Augusto sailing ship, a day at the Suwaki Aquapart, guided tours, participation in masses, meetings and games with peers from Poland. The youth are hosted at the Slesian Educational Centre in Ruanistok and the Warsaw Province is grateful to all those who supported the arrival and stay of the Ukrainian youth in the northeastern Poland region. On July 16th, at the Mary Help of Christians shrine in Buterere, Monsignor Gervais Banshimi Yubusa, Archbishop of Bujumbura, ordained Salishin Theory Bashimizi Mana to the priesthood. Present at the celebration were Father Pierre Celestin Ngoboka, Superior of the Africa Great Lakes Vice Province, numerous Salishins, members of the Salishin family, faithful and friends. So, viewers, with that, we have come to the end of today's edition. Till we meet again, thank you for joining us.